All right, so today we're doing Mila pickup tests. Um, Mila S7U1. Uh, you know, you may notice I have four rows and I have two on carpet, two on hard floor because I want to test it on its low low setting, which is curtains, and then I'll do it on its high setting, smooth, which is what you should normally run it on on carpets. So, because um, I like running it on curtains because it's so quiet, but it might not clean all that well. But that's why we we do this pickup test to see how it actually does. So, we're gonna start off with the low, uh, the, the, the low section, curtains. Let's get started. some rice out the back I think that's kind of interesting um let's go ahead and take a look uh this is where the belt drives I won't count that because I mean there's no way it could I mean it could be part of you know a bad design but that's pretty much how every vacuum is so I just won't count that and right down the middle this is where the belt is or the the, the middle guard is I don't know really why it's there but we're not going to count that but where it did clean left quite a bit of rice and a lot of sand <laughs> But it did pretty well on rocks. It, it left some rocks behind, but that's kind of normal. Um, flower did perfect on. A little bit left right there, but that's really fine. So uh, a lot of sand and qu quite a bit of rice, but that's really fine. So let's go ahead and try and pick the rest of that out. I want to mention I did a deep clean test on this and this got 62% so I would consider that failing for a deep pile but passing for low pile so just want to point that out it did not do amazing on the deep clean test okay so we're gonna put it up on a tie power setting and see how this does mm -hmm. So again, um, it does have a blind spot here. Is it there? Yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look. So, left a few little rocks, that's okay. Um, left a few rice grains and left a lot of sand. Can you see that? It left a lot of sand. Um, but overall, this passes, um, but it not passes perfectly. Um, flower, there's nothing left. I got all that, um, except right there, but that's where the belt is. So uh, the only thing that really failed here was the sand. Everything else seemed to be pretty good. So let's go ahead and pick the rest of this up. glad it didn't struggle with the large debris um it actually did the large debris very well so i'm impressed and i just noticed that this is a little bit too wide so what's gonna have to happen is when i put that down i'm going to have to move the carpet over 
have more room. Okay, there we go. So let's do hard floor now. Um, low low suction first, and then we'll do high. One second, let me move this out of the way. Okay, let's try that. So that picked up nothing. A little bit of flour, but overall that did really bad. So let me go ahead and clean that up now. Okay. Now we'll do high suction. See how well this does. Okay, a lot better for sure. Um, didn't pick up the rice or the rocks. And it left a lot of sand, but it did pretty well on flour. No, it left flour there. Left a few oats. So it so it left a little bit of every material. Overall, I'd say this vacuum does not perform very well on hard floors. Um, but that's just me. So let me clean that up now. So, this did not do well on hard floor. I'd say, overall, I, I was disappointed it, in its hard floor performance. And its carpet performance was pretty good um, on high power, which is pretty much what you're going to be running it on. The only thing it didn't do well on was sand. And I guess that, I mean, that's kind of disappointing in a machine at this price. Uh, but it did pretty well everything else. Um, so I feel com I feel comfortable running this in low suction. Um, I like running it in low suction if I'm just quickly cleaning up the garage because it it's quieter and I like that and I usually vacuum about 3 a.m. to clean the garage. So overall did pretty bad on hard floor, but I would say it passes carpet. Um, not perfectly, but it certainly does pass. So, thank you guys for watching this, and I'll see you guys in another video, and let me know what you think. Bye!